Hi guys, some people are asking me to put in developer mode and the configuration of my projector. Alright, uh, you go here in settings, right? And my projector is in Portuguese language, but I will change it to English. Uh, let me change it now. Um, let me see. Um, English, right here. Okay. Yeah, I changed it. Um, then you go in these sections, right? Let me back to the begin and show you uh, the step by step, right? You go here in settings, right? Then you go about device, and here you have some options. You know, about device, you have the uh, details about your software uh, of your projectors, right? And uh, here uh, you have another sections. Uh, local upgrading, right? Online upgrading. Uh, local upgrading is when you have uh, your files in one uh, pen drive, right? Uh, then you can um, update it um, by your pen drive, right? And then you go online upgrades uh, you have these options for you update it uh, online right you check for updates and you can use it uh, for upgrade your your projector right you can check here if you have some update uh, for your projector as you know, uh, I didn't not find any versions because I have read um, the last one version for my projector. Then, uh, if you click here about device and click several times, your you press your control, remote control. Uh, you press uh, sometimes this way and you see and uh, option and uh, the set model uh, is turned one and this means that you will have more options in your <coughs> developer mode mode you know um, then you back and uh, you will have this uh, settings for your projectors like yet uh, network setting bluetooth settings language set setting audio setting projection setting date and time settings and other settings here you have more sets and about uh, application sets you have already uh, if you are not in developer mode, um, you have these two options. Uh, factor reset and setting, it's uh, very useful if you have some problems with your with your software, right? Um, you can reset uh, to the factor mode, you know, and uh, you can start again uh, your your upgrading right if you have some problems in, in trying to update your projectors and it's not doing the download of it on internet you are trying the the software is not uh, um, doing the download you can um, back your projector to the uh, factory reset, reset settings you know and uh, you will be able to 
upgrade upgrade your uh, projector updating your projector uh, developer opinions I don't know what is that exactly but probably it's some things and uh, that uh, I will not uh, use it right advanced in settings that's useful if you want to change uh, colors of your projectors uh, access other things other settings about your projector device preferences uh, you can change languages you can change some things here let me try to focus it like here you have other options you know you can change your display um, to other other uh, contrast and um, brightness and uh, backlight colors you have other options here so like uh, if you press this present model uh, you have more options like uh, preset model right custom standard you can see it's changing the color cinema vvd game model <coughs> then you choose the better for you and uh, the best one that you like i put in an um hdr uh, model and uh, you can back and you have more colors you know more vvd or better colors for your your application you know your software and uh, as you can see here it's a little better a little better the colors that they use here You see it then these options uh, about uh, about um, developer model appears just when you are able uh, to get the developer model model you know uh, and just if you want to access it you need to make it that I did it then you go on about advice uh, click again about advice and click several times on your control remote in the option okay and we will appear the setup model it's channel one right then you have these options other settings you this one these two ones these two last ones will appear for you in your uh, projector screens you know uh, then it's that uh, if you want to know some things about it or more about configurations uh, I can make another videos about it uh, here in projections in projector in projection setting you can use other stuff like screen zone um, projector projection mode uh, case stone corrections here you can use the manual operations or you can click here and will be automatically make the corrections for you but I like to use the manual operations because I can uh, let the screens in the size that I want and in the forms that I want, you know. Uh, then it's that, that I want to show you, and uh, um, I will make some more videos about it and uh, about the projector using it on my PC 
and uh, watching movies series i don't know <laughs> on youtube uh, on my pc you know and uh here i have the youtube right some videos and uh, that i can use it on my, PC, on my projector you see it's a good one I'm really liking this projector and the colors. I'm uh, actually I'm using it on the wall in a white wall. I'm not using a screen for it, but uh, probably someday I will buy some screen, uh, especially uh, for the projector, right? And. Uh, but right now I'm just using with my wall and, I, and my wall of my house it's white it's a it's a kind of uh, ice white you know ice white and I use it and I'm, I think it's very good it's really good look at I have um, contrast I have a nice uh, image on my wall you know uh, the projection the projection it's uh, really good I will try to go next to it show you look at what do you think about it uh, just tell me uh, what do you think uh, let your comments there um, and we can uh, share our opinions experiences and this projector I will try to get I will try to I will try to get more projectors in the future because I need money to buy it and uh, to test it for you and me too because I like projectors uh, actually I don't have TV because I prefer my projector but in this case with this projector you need to use it uh, not so long time because it's not a projector for use uh, the whole days you know um, the whole day um, if you want to use it I recommend you to use your projectors by two or three hours and uh, get some rest of him uh, uh, turn off your projectors let the projector uh, third minutes uh, turn it off turn it off right um, to refresh your projectors right and uh, you can uh, use it again I don't recommend you to use these projectors um, for a long time because you will have problems uh, with your screen uh, if you use it for so long time because can burn your screen uh, inside of your projectors right then I hope you enjoy your projectors a lot and uh, if you have some problems just let me know and uh, who knows uh, other stuff about a projector uh, some things new uh, just let me know just send me a message and uh, just share our uh, knowledge about it you know and uh, and uh, it's I'm staying by here and uh, have a good have a good projector there have a good entertainment right um, see you in the next video